Hello friends, welcome to Tamales Toys. Today we are going on a fun adventure to learn all about bugs and where they live. We will meet toy bugs first and then see their real life friends in nature. Let's begin with our first bug friend the ant. This toy ant lives in the ground. Real ants dig tunnels and live in big ant colonies. Ants are very smart and work together to carry food. Next is the ladybird. This cute toy ladybird lives on leaves and flowers. Real ladybirds are also called ladybugs. They love to eat tiny insects that hurt plants. Now let's meet the butterfly. Our toy butterfly has beautiful wings. Real butterflies live in gardens and fields. They love flowers and help move pollen from one flower to another. That is called pollination. This toy caterpillar wiggles slowly. Real caterpillars live on leaves. They eat leaves and grow into butterflies or moths. Look at this beetle. This toy beetle is shiny and black. Real beetles live under rocks and logs. They help clean nature by eating old plants. Our next bug is the spider. This toy spider has eight legs. Real spiders spin webs to catch FLIs. They live in corners, trees or grass. Now we have the bee. This toy bee is fuzzy and yellow. Real bees live in hives and make honey. They also help flowers grow by pollinating them. Let's look at the grasshopper. This toy grasshopper has long legs. Real grasshoppers live in grass and fields. They jump very high. That's how they move around. Now meet the dragonfly. This toy dragonfly has shiny wings. Real dragonflies live near ponds and lakes. They fly very fast and eat mosquitoes. Speaking of mosquitoes here is a toy mosquito. Real mosquitoes live near water and they buzz when they fly. Next we have the moth. This toy moth looks like a fuzzy butterfly. Real moths come out at night and like to fly around lights. They rest during the day. Let's meet the stick insect. This toy stick insect looks just like a twig. Real stick insects hide on branches so no one sees them. That's called camouflage. Now we have the centipede. This toy centipede has many legs. Real centipedes live under rocks and logs. They move fast and like the dark. This is a millipede. This toy millipede is round and curled up. Real millipedes live in soil and eat old leaves. They help recycle nature. Here is the earwig. This toy earwig has tiny pincers. Real earwigs hide under leaves and come out at night. They are shy and helpful to plants. Now we have the silverfish. This toy silverfish is shiny and small. Real silverfish live in dark corners and eat paper and crumbs. Look at the cicada. This toy cicada has big eyes. Real cicadas live in trees and make loud sounds. They come out in warm weather. Next is the lacewing. This toy lacewing has delicate wings. Real lacewings eat plant pests and are helpful in gardens. Here is the hornet. This toy hornet looks like a big wasp. Real hornets live in nests and protect their homes. They are strong and fly fast. Now we have the wasp. This toy wasp is black and yellow. Real wasps live in paper nests and help control pests. Some wasps also pollinate flowers. Look at this cockroach. This toy cockroach is brown and shiny. Real cockroaches live in dark places and come out at night. They are very fast. Now meet the bumblebee. This toy bumblebee is round and fuzzy. Real bumblebees live in small hives underground or in tree holes. They are gentle and love flowers. This is a toy bug called a shield bug. Real shield bugs live on leaves and have strong smells to protect themselves. They are also called stink bugs. Now let's look at the firefly. This toy firefly lights up. Real fireflies glow in the dark. They use their light to find friends. That is called bioluminescence. Now let's see what makes each of our bug friends so special. Ants work together as a team. They build tunnels and carry food many times their size. Spiders are amazing builders. They spin webs to catch food and rest. Bees and butterflies are pollinators. They move pollen between flowers to help fruits and seeds grow. Ladybirds and lacewings help plants by eating bad insects. Fireflies can glow in the dark to talk to each other. Stick insects can hide by looking just like a stick. That is called camouflage. Dragonflies can fly in all directions. They are fast and like to live near water. Grasshoppers can leap very far using their strong back legs. 
Cicadas sing loud songs from trees. They come out after sleeping underground for years. Millipedes and beetles help nature stay clean by eating old leaves and plants. Earwigs use their pincers to defend themselves and hide during the day. Moths fly at night and rest during the day. Hornets and wasps are strong and help keep nature balanced. Cockroaches can live almost anywhere and move quickly. Silverfish are shy and hide in small spaces. Mosquitoes buzz and feed on nectar or sometimes animals. Shield bugs can make smells to stay safe. Bumblebees are gentle and good at pollinating. Each bug has a special job and a special home. Let's remember all the homes we saw. Ants live underground. Spiders live in webs. Ladybirds live on leaves. Bees live in hives. Beetles and centipedes live under rocks. Grasshoppers live in fields. Butterflies live in gardens. Fireflies glow at night. Mosquitoes live near water. Silverfish and cockroaches hide in dark corners. Stick insects live on branches. Earwigs hide under leaves. Cicadas sing from trees. Hornets live in nests. Moths sleep during the day. Dragonflies live near ponds. Millipedes live in soil. Every bug has a home that fits just right for them. And now we know how toy bugs are just like the real ones in nature. Thank you for exploring the tiny world of bugs with us today. We hope you had fun learning about where bugs live what they do and why they are special. Please like this video and subscribe to Tamales Toys for more fun and relaxing videos. See you next time. Let's learn about some bugs that help keep the world clean. First, we have the dung beetle. This toy dung beetle is small and strong. Real dung beetles roll animal poop into balls. They bury it and lay their eggs inside. This keeps the ground clean and gives baby beetles a safe place to grow. Next is the woodlouse. This toy woodlouse is gray and round. Real woodless live under stones and eat dead plants. They help break down old leaves into soil. That's called decomposing. Here is the termite. This toy termite looks like a tiny ant. Real termites build nests in wood and underground. They help nature by breaking down dead wood. Now meet the hoverfly. This toy hoverfly looks like a bee, but it cannot sting. Real hoverflies live in gardens and fly around flowers. They help pollinate just like bees. Their babies eat aphids which are pests on plants. That helps gardens grow better. Let's look at the praying mantis. This toy mantis has big eyes and front legs. Real mantises live in trees and bushes. They sit very still and catch other bugs for food. They help keep bug numbers balanced. Now we have the water strider. This toy water strider has long legs. Real water striders live on top of ponds. They skate across the water without sinking. Their legs spread out their weight like magic. Let's meet the glowworm. This toy glowworm is green and glowing. Real glowworms live in caves and dark places. They use their glow to attract food and friends. That is also called bioluminescence. Some bugs do not just live on land. They live in water or even float in the sky. First is the mayflea. This toy mayflea is small and light. Real mayflies live in water as babies and then fly in the air for only one day. They live near clean rivers and ponds. Here is the back swimmer. This toy bug floats on its back. Real back swimmers live in ponds and swim upside down. They use their back legs like oars. Now let's see the damselfly. This toy damselfly is thin and blue. Real damselflies are like dragonflies but smaller. They live near water and have wings that fold when they land. Next is the gnat. This toy gnat is tiny. Real gnats fly in groups and live in moist areas. Some bite, but many just fly and feed on plants. Meet the crane fly. This toy crane fly looks like a big mosquito. Real crane FLIs do not bite. They live in grassy fields and near water. Their legs are very long and gentle. Now we have the antlion. This toy antlion has sharp jaws. Real antlion babies dig little sand traps to catch ants. They live in dry sandy places and are very clever hunters. As adults they grow wings and fly like dragonflies. Look at the leafhopper. This toy leafhopper is green and bouncy. Real leafhoppers live on plants and jump very far. They suck plant juice with tiny straws. Now we meet the whirligig beetle. This toy beetle spins around. Real whirligig beetles live on ponds and spin in circles on the surface. 
Their eyes can look above and below water at the same time. Now, let's learn how some bugs change as they grow. These changes are called life cycles. The butterfly starts as an egg. Then it becomes a caterpillar. The caterpillar eats and grows. Then it makes a cocoon called a chrysalis. After resting inside, it becomes a butterfly. That is called metamorphosis. Moths do the same. Their baby is also a caterpillar. Bees begin as eggs inside a hive. The egg turns into a larva. The larva is fed by other bees. Then it becomes a pupa and finally an adult bee. Ladybirds start as tiny black larvae. They crawl on plants and eat bugs. Then they form a pupa and become red and spotted ladybirds. Froghoppers also go through changes. Their babies live inside foamy bubbles on plants and turn into strong jumping bugs. Fireflies begin as glowing baby grubs. They live in the ground and then turn into glowing adults. Dragonflies begin as nymphs in water. They live underwater for years. Then they crawl out and become flying dragonflies. Grasshoppers do not change as much. They hatch from eggs and look like small adults. They grow bigger and shed their skin. That is called molting. Praying mantises hatch as tiny versions and grow the same way. Mosquitoes lay eggs in water. Their babies are called wrigglers. They float and swim until they grow into flying mosquitoes. Bugs grow in different ways, but all bugs start small and grow into something amazing. Let's go on one last bug adventure. Imagine walking through a garden. You see bees buzzing in flowers, ladybirds crawling on leaves, butterflies flying in the sun. Under a rock you find beetles and ants. On a tree a spider spins a web. On a branch a stick insect hides. Near a pond a dragonfly zips by. You see tiny bugs in the soil. Some glow in the dark. Some sing. Some jump. Some crawl. All of them live in their perfect bug homes. Each bug has a role. Some clean. Some pollinate. Some protect. Some build. All are important. Toys help us learn. But real bugs show us how wonderful nature is. We hope you loved meeting all these bugs and learning where they live what they do and why they are special. Bugs are tiny but they do big things. Thank you for watching this relaxing bug adventure with Tamales Toys. If you had fun please click like and subscribe to Tamales Toys for more fun and educational videos. See you again next time. Bye bye bug friends.